Um, as a whole, I feel like we flew around to the ball. Um, we had a lot of a lot of pass breakups. Our defensive backs did a great job of making sure they smothered the receivers. Um, the defensive line did a great job of getting a lot of push on the quarterback and making him get rid of the ball before he wanted to. Um, Kennard Johnson, my fellow linebacker, he flew he flew around every time I wasn't around the ball, he was around the ball. So I feel like as a defense, as a whole, we definitely played lights out defense. So. Well, what does is, what is Coach Towns tell you guys uh, after the game? Um, he told us that um, he was he was proud of us. He, he feel like we definitely played bulldog defense. He's had a lot of great defenses in his years here, and um, giving up 166 yards, he, he he was definitely proud of us and then the way that we performed. So um, he just told us to keep it up, you know, um, celebrate this win, celebrate the way we played for that night, and um, you know, move on to Tuskegee for the next day. So. Now, what kind? Of, now you, you played well, but it's the first game. Everyone makes mistakes. What kinds of things do you feel like the defense needs to get better at? Um, we definitely. Uh, one of the goals that we didn't reach out of our eight goals is the third down uh, percentage. We shoot for 33 or less, and we let them get to 37. So um, we got to do a better job of getting off the field, getting three and outs. Um, they also hurt us on uh, the quick quick tempo, and um, we, we definitely got to do a better job of not letting fatigue set in, remembering our plays and what we're supposed to do, and um, just, you know, just be able to pick, go quick tempo with the offense and play the same defense that we used to play Was it conditioning? Was it just being the first game? Or what do you think was the, the hard part there? Um, I don't think it was conditioning because we've done a lot of running. Coach Hester has made sure that we were in very good shape over the summer and throughout camp. So um, I don't think that it was really the conditioning part. I just feel like that um, people started to get a little bit confused um, when they got to get down and they don't have time to get in the huddle and let their mind reset for the next play. They just got to get the call real quick and line down. It kind of threw them off a little bit. And um, we hadn't really went over a lot of quick tempo in practice, so I think that kind of caught us off guard. I think we'll be ready for it next time. Uh, what about Tuskegee? What do they, what do, they do with that uh, presents problems for you guys? Um, well, Tuskegee is a, a run-heavy team. Um, they like to cut block. They like to uh, cut a lot. Uh, the fullbacks, they, you know, they won't take you on. They'll try to cut you a lot. So um, I feel like this week we need to stress a lot on how to defeat the chop block and still be able to keep your feet, stay lateral to the ball and, and make plays. So I feel like um, if we stress that a lot this week, that we, sh we shouldn't have much of a problem. How, how do you, this is the first game and you guys got to win and that's great, but you don't really know the dynamic or the identity, I guess, of the team yet. Do you feel like it's a group of guys that's able to, to put it behind them and get right back to work today and forget about anything that's happened in the past? Yeah, um, I feel like um, right now uh, we have a very young offense and those guys are really just trying to learn each other, fill each other out and um, really get a, a feel for what everybody's going to be able to do, how to move, how to take each step and um, learn everybody's strengths and weaknesses on game time situations. So I feel like as a defense, we're going to have to, uh, at least for the first half of the season, we're definitely going to have to come out the way we did this pre previous game and set the tone and uh, just pretty much lead the team for a while until our offense can completely gel together so we can be one bulldog machine. There you go. I'm good.